How's it going, everybody? I'm David, and welcome to Sucker for Love. Listen. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> She's breathing on me. Okay, so... Um, this is a Cthulhu type deal. If you wanted to date Cthulhu, this is the game for you. And uh, I just decided that we were gonna, you know, date Cthulhu. Okay, there we go. I want a new date, baby. Get a new date going on, bro. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, survive chapter one to unlock. Find all three secrets to unlock. Oh, ski doke ski. Oh. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Lynetta, my really scary girlfriend. Oh, man. Oh, man, dude. This is about to be fun. I've never had a scary girlfriend before. I don't know why my brain just kind of went with like those weird ass uh, anime watchers that just go like, oh, I've never had a anime girlfriend before. That, that, to me, that's that's stupid as fuck, by the way. Eldritch gods, cosmic horrors, things beyond our understanding. To merely gaze upon their form is to abandon all hope. The only thing protecting all of reality from the final co coalescence of insanity and terror is the fact that the unspeakable unspeakable gods wait dreaming their awakening un under aligned stars heralds the ends today the stars are aligned damn it come on already same day shipping my ass i only have half an hour tops until the stars move out of position i better wash my face to calm down a year ago, I saw the face of an eldritch being in my dreams. Hey, we look cute. We're looking cute there, buddy. Uh, it whispered its name to me. Lynetta. Ever since, I've been obsessed with trying to see it again. I'm not the kind of person to get addicted to stuff or spin recklessly, but I can't... I just can't help myself. Well, I spin recklessly all the time, buddy. Uh, there's something I have to do once I see it again. God, fuck! Knock a little less cr fucking loud and a little bit more quietly, thank you. Was that the door? Thank goodness. I spent way too much money on getting this for me to miss my chance. The amount of money I've lost to scammers claiming to have the real deal is a little embarrassing. But as of today, as of today, I'll have a genuine ne Necronomicon, an ancient spellbook containing the dark rituals needed to contact the Elder Gods. Finally, I'll... Huh? It's pink. Huh? What the hell is this? Why is it pink? Isn't this supposed to be like brown and bitter? <laughs> oh, shut up, Hyde. This is supposed to be an ancient book covered in flesh or something. This looks like it came from an office supply store. No, please don't tell me. Scammed again. With how much money I spent this time, I thought it, there'd be no chance it'd be a fake. Well, buddy, it looks like you were wrong though. Great, no way I'm getting my money back either. The scammer is probably long gone too. Damn it, I need a new hobby. Seriously. What a strange scam though. You'd think they'd at least try to go for an authentic look. Did they really think nobody would notice that their Book of the Dead is Malibu Pink? Hey, ain't nothing wrong with Malibu Pink, bitch. That's how you know you're fabulous. Wait, is this symbol on the front embossed? Is this thing made of real leather? The pages look gilt and gold, too. Well, that's a very fucking expensive fake. And this weight, why'd they make a knockoff out of such high quality materials? Maybe it's not a fake, buddy boy. Oh, my computer. That's probably just the delivery confirmation message. It's arriving to 100% real Necronomicon, not clickbait, not a scam. Gone sexual? <laughs> I found the title for the video, guys. I found it. It's right here. What the? My order was delayed? It won't be delivered until tomorrow? Then what the hell is this book supposed to be? Did it get delivered to me by accident or something? There's no shipping label on the box. Stranger still, th this inscription at the bottom, it's... Re relaying. 
word. The word that I don't know. Uh, the unholy language of the eldritch gods. Also, the pages reeks of formaldehyde, embalming fluid. In other words, it stinks of death. Why would something so cute have such an insidious aura around it? Maybe I'll take a look inside. Yeah, you do that, buddy o pal. Oh, we can light things. Uh, look, it's us. I believe that's us anyway. Um, the calling. Ensure all possible light has been snuffed from the room. In th your room, this means draw your curtains, turn off your bedside lamp, turn off overhead lights. Mm, it is okay. Oh, no. Hey! Oh. <laughs> okay. Draw the curtain. Da -da -da. Hey! In off a room. Okay. Find and put on a ritual necklace. Ritual necklace. I wore the ritual necklace. Lenafart Mikle. Okay. Lynetta, I fart. God damn it. Lin Lynetta, I fart. How is that too fast? Okay, fine. Is this better? I megath dish do niggly. Listen, sir. Okay, fine. Just inch it. Just gotta barely drag it. Do 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 do. Wrong candles. What? Oh, light red fire candles. God damn it. <laughs> red fire candles. All right. Lynetta, I fart in your face so you can be my hot, sexy girlfriend because you are big, scary, and pink. Baby, you'll breathe on me with your tentacles. Mortal. I am mortal. Oh, God. It actually worked. She's here. A beacon of madness is towering over me. An om omnipotent and chaotic avatar of the world-ending calamity. Even with the year of preparation for this moment, I'm frozen in fear. For what purpose have you awoken Lanetta the star spawn and brought about the end of reality? Because I want to suck on your tentacles, bitch! I can't talk. I can't even breathe. You can get to sucking, though. Just suck the tentacles. Suck them right off of her face. <laughs> Blinding dread, choking terror, my very sanity is teetering on the precipice. And looking down, no, I finally got this far. I finally have my chance. I can't perish now. D -d Dark One, I ask that you grant my wish. You wish to be the first human to be destroyed, yes? I mean, not, not really. Uh, no, I don't think I, I think we can skip the you destroying me part and just get right to the me sucking on your face No, I want to smooch you what? Do I have to repeat myself I want to smooch you bitch <laughs> I want to smooch Being driven mad with love Drink with the urge to smooch your tentacly face, bitch. Pucker up if you can. Pucker up. I don't know. Tentacles are weird for me. I, I just look. I haven't been getting a lot of kissing here lately. I just want to kiss, okay? I'm mad with lust. I said love. He said lust. You know, tomato, tomato. There. No, you're here. I can. I can I, I, I lit this room for you. I chanted th that I would fart on you. you. You know, I went through all the trouble. You could at least just chill for a bit. Maybe watch some Netflix. I could put on Happy. Huh? But you just got here. How about destroying reality as I know it? I'll do it next time. Maybe when the stars realign in a thousand years or so. 
Why, why wait a thousand years what you could do today? You know, that's what my grandpappy always said. But I'll be long dead by then. You won't be able to smooch me. Hey, I know I'm ugly, but I'm not that damn ugly. Hey, I went through all the trouble of finding this damn book. The least you could do is... Oh, well, that's a fucking flippin' character. First, you're like, oh, I don't want to be with you. I don't want to go back. I don't want to end reality because you're ugly. I show that I got a frickin' pink-ass book, and you're just like, oh, where'd you get the book? I'll tell you where I got the book. A random fucking box. Huh? What this? I found it outside my door. I don't know Moo. Moo? Who's that? Are they the one who left this funny looking Necronomicon on my doorstep? Is it? Is it not? It's not? That's what I said! God, she's cute. But what's with this sudden personality change? Does she recognize the book? Uh, well, she might. We got a smooch meter here. I want a smooch. Pucker up, girly. Uh, well, if it's not a Necronomicon, what is it? Oh. That makes it wonderful. For what? <sighs> so you're saying I get a smooch? What? Really? This thing? Okay. Okay. Okie dokie. So I don't go fucking insane. All right. I struck gold! All the money I spent finally paid off! Wait, what'd she just say? Protect my sanity? I am a cosmic entity beyond comprehension. Fuck, you got some thighs though, woman! Are well, are you a woman? Snap like a reed at any moment, actually. Oh, well, if you put my mind in between those thighs, I think I'll be pretty fucking happy. Anyway, moving on. Uh, well, nope. You give me a thousand subscribers? Oh wait, no, I think she means she, she gonna smooch me. All right. <laughs> you let me smooch you? Obviously, because I'm David fucking Leaf, dude. I can make it. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> You're scary. <laughs> Will you spare the world if I win that kiss? No, oh, well, fuck. You knew what you were getting into when you woke me up, right, darling? I just wanted to kiss you. I didn't want to end reality as I knew it. I just wanted to get a big old fat juicy smooch. Looks like my only two options are die or die without getting a kiss. Hmm. Well, they say if you're already eating the poison, you might as well lick the plate. Uh, well, I've never really heard that saying, but, you know, I guess that's right. If you're going to die, you might as well die happy. So if the world is going to end either way, deal. Okay. I'm gonna invoke the depths. Okay, we just uh, do a boop. Do not perform this ritual alone. Well, I per I believe Miss uh, Thunder Thighs is in here. Snuff all light from the room. Turn on your sink or shower to make the when the okay. Coolio, snuff a delight. Hey, who opened these windows? Oh, nobody did. Off. I don't want any light. Oh, you, no. Look at, wait, does she not have feet? Wait, where'd my mouse go? Okay. Talk. What's with the worried look, darling? Ah, nothing. I, I shouldn't be doing these spells alone. The book says so. I'm here. Uh, well, I said that. You know what I mean? These rituals look really bad for my long-term health. <laughs> Well, okay, so it's not good for my short-term health, then. Nobody is in this world for the long haul anymore. You what? Did you give me a smooch? Well, these rituals look bad for my short-term health, too. See, me and this dude is on the same fucking wavelength. Well, you better finish them quickly, then. Well, that's fucking rude. Okay, I'm gonna enter here. Hey, we're pink. 
Back away. I'm gonna keep the pink. We're gonna turn our shower on. Exit the roo. Hey, I did it! Okay, do not look out your window from out now on. No man good booth. Ul eager the out really in the yoga film. I think I did it. It's really fucking dark now. Are we? What did I just do? It said invoke the depth, not bring out the outer depth. That doesn't sound really healthy. Well, at least not for me. Will I be okay? Uh, maybe? No, 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 no. Wait, why are you leaving? Getting a little icky from the summoning, so I wanted to use your shower. Do you mind? Hell no. Nah. No, no, no. Not at all. Go ahead. Thanks. No peeking. I will never. <laughs> okay. Don't peek. That's hey. I won't. I won't. I won't peek. Sure you won't? Positive. I'll say, Violet Anna. Should I? No, 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 no. Well, you know what? Oh, Nana. Should I? No, no, no. I I'm not gonna do it, guys. I'm not gonna do it. She'll probably just kill me. All right. Um, invoke the depth. Um, ensure your sink or shower is running while well, she's doing that already. Then go outside. They'll know if you saw them. Turn off the lights before you leave. This one isn't a warning. It'll just help. <laughs> okay. Um, well, it seems like everything's off anyway. Well, I don't want to open that because it said not to look out your window anymore. So, is outside here? Hello? Okay. Alright. Alright. Ye milligurd here, Estella Bisnagda Bab. A mega pickle. The mig pukta. Jeez, it looks like quiet hill out here with all this fog. Is something moving out there? Oh! God damn it! Oh, fucking, fucking, fuck. No, I didn't. I don't know what I did. What I do? Foggy, rainy days by the sea. It's like my favorite weather on the surface world. Well, it's definitely foggy. A little shitty because I think I shit my pants, but that's not something you need to know. No, you have a house on the water. I don't think I do. I think this is an apartment complex, and I'm pretty sure out there I saw kind of a, a, a fucking city, but you know, I didn't five minutes ago. Well, yeah, well, fuck. In fact, I'm hundreds of kilometers from the coast. Even the wildest of hurricanes would never flood the area like this. What terrible power is this thing capable of? Oh, there's something just so romantic about standing on a balcony during a storm. I don't know about romantic, but you definitely gave me a fucking heart attack. I'd hate to cut the fun short, but can we go back inside now? Darling, getting chilly? Ah, maybe. It feels like something's watching me from out there. Well, I mean, maybe. After all, this page in the book has an unspeakable horror on it. Ha! Huh. Unspeakable horror? Some kind of monster's gonna jump out at me? Oh, man. I, I don't want to go in. All right. Chant. I cannot pronounce that. What the hell? I can't even begin to pronounce this. Oh, shut up. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Wait. You can pronounce this? I can, I can pronounce anything. 
Anything? Anything? Oh yeah? Then what's this? It's pronounced Worcestershire? I always pronounce it Worcestershire. What the fuck? Damn, you are the real deal. Hey, wait a minute. Those tentacles are like extra tongues, right? Then your weakness is tongue twisters. Say toy boat 10 times fast. Well, that's a flaw in the system. But if that, I mean, hey, if she has extra tongues, Frenchin should be interesting. <laughs> Show off. All right. Oh, T D O T. Uh, Eldritch Mouth. This uh, ritual will allow you to utter unspeakable incantations. Hey, that's useful. Uh, perform this ritual someplace where the gore can be cleaned easy, like a bathroom, where no robes or amulets. Have a ritual knife on your person. Okay, so... Items, maybe? Okay, I can't be wearing that. I don't have a thing. I need this. Ugh, <laughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, wait. Hey, Lynetta! Oh, wait, that's not what I meant to do. Lynetta! Oh, she don't want to talk to me. <laughs> I just wanted to talk to you, Lynetta! She didn't want to talk to me. She said, fuck you. I wish she would, though. All right. Uh, Migoka. Yai. Miginigopag. Nigsteak. Yemigulna. Eldrin's mouth, huh? Should I have a contender scale more carefully before casting it? If there's as much as a single star, I might actually lose my job. Please don't tell me I have something freaky on my space. It's my livelihood on the line here. Okay, big breaths. Brace yourself. Hey, I'm, I'm still cute as hell. <laughs> but I thought I'd get an Eldrith mouth or something. Everything seems pretty much the same. Weird. Hey, Lynetta. Yes. Oh God, motherfucking damn it. What is up with you and jump scares? Ah, you startled me. Well, you just can't just, can't just whoopooski all up in my face. Uh, uh, who the hell was that third voice? Was it? She takes a hold of my hand. Whoa, hand holding on the first date. Moving fast, but that's okay. No, look at your hand, silly. What if I? You couldn't just let me think that you were trying to hold my hand. My my hand. Well, now you have to kiss me twice. <laughs> oh, fuck! What did you- Get- Get- Get it off! Quick, grab that knife from the bedroom to cut it off! Hurry! But it's your hand now. See? Surely enough, it's not a disembodied mouth stuck to my hand. It's very much embodied mouth indeed. <sighs> Is this really my hand? What, what did I do to my hand? <laughs> That no, fucking no, apparently. This is screwed up. I mean, I knew I'd be in harm's way, but permanent body disfigurement this early on? Wait. <laughs> Something to think about. Anyway. But, but I'm not stopping before I get that smooch. No matter what. I'm just gonna think positive. This isn't so bad. <laughs> I mean, there's gonna be, there's gotta be a silver lining to this. <laughs> now I, I have my pick of which mouth to use when I smooch ya. <laughs> is someone at the door? This is bad. Did I get busted? The sudden shock feels like a splash of cold water that snaps me to my senses. And. I believe that will be the end of this episode because the glare's coming in to this and I do want enough to kind of like make this a whole fracking series. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button with all your power. Also, if you want to become a good egg, you know, just hit that subscribe button down below. And I'll see all you amazing, beautiful people in the next video. Have a